So guys, I made a reroll guide on how to reroll um, the different processes to rerolling for Goddess of Genesis S. And one of the biggest hurdles you had to overcome was the fact that you could not delete the actual guest account because it was actually linked to your device ID. Well, we cracked the code and we're going to go ahead and break through that. I'm going to show you guys how to do so. So you can go ahead and do it on your mobile devices if you have root. You will require root access to your mobile device or your emulator. I highly recommend you do this on an emulator because I don't want you guys out there jailbreaking your phones if you don't want to. If you're tech savvy and if you want to do that, that's fine. But I highly suggest and recommend you do this on an emulator. And you can see here that we're currently using LD Player. You can do this on Knox as well. Um, those are two solid emulators that you can use for this process. It's going to save you a lot of time, a lot of headache, and re-rolling on the game. And we're going to show you how it works, how quick it is, how simple it is, and, you know, put it in action. Now, you will need a root browser. Some emulators will come with a root browser. Some of them you're going to have to go and grab from Google Play. Any root browser that allows you to have root access to your game's files, that's all you need. It doesn't have to be anything fancy, and you don't have to buy it. It's 100% free. You can find a lot of good free ones. I'm currently using Root Browser Classic by Jay Rummy. One of my uh, favorite ones that I've been using for years. It's just a solid... Uh, one to use it's just so simple and I'm just very accustomed to it so that's the one that I chose to use you can see it here I'll go and open it up so you guys can kind of see what the UI looks like it's very old school looking uh, just go ahead and click that it's always going to ask you to download utilities you don't even really have to do it to be honest but so you're going to come to this uh, this page here you're going to have a lot of different files what you're going to be looking for is data okay and then data again and then we're going to go all the way down here to the bottom, and we're going to find the um, SEA version or the English version, depending on what version you're playing on. We're going to do the SEA version here for testing. So you can go and pop that, and then you're going to go down to shared, pre, uh, prefs, shared prefs, and then you're going to go all the way down here until you see pd underscore device id dot xml. You're going to go ahead and open that. We're going to go ahead and just use the editor. And then you're going to see this here. You're going to see a string name device ID. This is basically uh, your device's ID that's being attached to your guest account. And you need to manipulate that ID in a way so it tricks the game into thinking that your device has been disconnected and, and or you've changed your device. So when you go to try and log back into that guest account, it will no longer be there. It'll say it's expired and then it'll allow you to run a new guest account. And that's what we want. So let's go ahead and show this off in action. So let's go ahead and open up uh, Goddess of Genesis, the uh, Southeast Asian version of the game for testing here. Should come up our guest ID here in a moment. There we go. 4514436 guest ID. Go ahead and open that up. You'll see here, we have a level one character on sealed chamber server. And just so you know, you know, this is the SCA version. You can see all the servers here. So the sealed chamber, we have a level one uh, fresh, you know, account there that has no username, nothing. I didn't really do anything with it. So now what we want to do is we want to go back into the root browser here. And we're just going to manipulate any of these numbers. So let's say right here what says 1035. We're just going to go ahead and take out that three and we're going to put a two and then we're going to save it. File was successfully saved. We're going to go back in here to the game. We're going to go back and we're going to exit out and then we're going to go back into it and it'll come up trying to log us into that guest account, but it'll say the account has been expired, which will then allow us to create a whole new guest account. So it's a very simple process. So it's going to try and log us in. And there you go. Account has expired. Please log in. So we're going to click guest again. Click confirm. Go back into the servers. And we should have nothing there. There you go. No account. Guest account has been deleted. You're welcome. <laughs> we figured this out several hours ago. I just didn't have time to make the video because I got swamped with a lot of things. I had other videos I had to get out as well. Um, and then we also, of course, had the game drop on global, so I've been farming that up so I can show you guys uh, some things with the global side of the game. 
And uh, but that's pretty much it, guys. That is how you use a root device, either an emulator, which I highly recommend, or a mobile device, um, to go ahead and go in with a root browser and just simply edit a file very quickly to trick the system into deleting the uh, the account, the guest account, so you don't have to worry about that. So now you can reroll on one device. You don't need multiple instances, guys, if you don't want to. So. There y'all go. Hopefully that was helpful. If it was, definitely give me a thumbs up. It really helps the channel, helps the algorithm here on YouTube. Uh, don't forget to subscribe here if you're new as well for more Goddess of Genesis content, other content we cover here on the channel. Uh, go ahead and follow me at Twitter, or on Twitter, at Josh Verts. There we go. And uh, go ahead and join us in the Discord and description below if you have any questions or concerns or having any trouble. Uh, you know, comment below or, of course, um, message me in the Discord and uh me or someone else will hopefully try to help you as best we can. So there you guys go. You can delete the guest accounts now on Goddess of Genesis. Hopefully this encourages a lot more players to come in because now re-rolling might not be as bad as it initially was. So there y'all go. Until next time, as always, peace.